they do have a breakdown of how much everything costs. So, uh, the clam, 50 gold. Not bad. Daffodil, 30. Broken CD, of course, was none. Oh, no, okay. Still 30 per fish, regardless. Fair enough. And the seaweed, which I actually meant to keep. Oops. The hell was that noise about? Welcome to the KOZP5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. I'm not, do I have to do that voice every time, guys? <laughs> I mean, seriously, do I have to do that voice every time I'm reading the uh, the news report there? Right. I wonder how many stone we've got in total now. 24? 25? Why not? See, it's weird with the control with the when I'm using keyboard and mouse for hold shift. It makes five when I left click, but I can't seem to do that with the control pad. Come on. Stick that over there out of the way. I will have to move that box in just a minute. Um, one. Come on, two, three, and four. Nice. Right, let's get that box out of the way. Oh, it won't whilst there's items in there. Oops. Oh, you can pick that stuff back up. Nice. Um. Okay, let's delete the mixed seeds. We can get more of them later on. You don't have to. <laughs> Thank you very much. There we go. Right, where should put this? Let's put it right... There. And, you know what, let's go ahead and put them in there as well whilst they're not being used. Makes sense to keep our inventory as clear as possible. You know, just like Minecraft. Obviously, the more space we've got cleared off, the uh, more resources we have to use. A geode. You found a geode. The local blacksmith can break it open for you. Who knows what may be hidden inside? Cool. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, yeah. Aside from having all the extra resources, we also have more space for more crops, which gives us more money. Uh, which is the basis upon everything in every game, regardless as to what the game is about. Yes, I think that's what I meant to say. <laughs> At some point, you know, we're going to need space for new buildings and things. Oh, speaking of which, I have no idea what this building is about yet. None whatsoever. Whatever this was once... Well, whatever this once was, it's now in ruins. Given its shape, I, I'm tend, to, I'm leaning towards it was a uh, greenhouse. That's what I'm thinking, or hot house. You know, same thing essentially. What do you guys think?
Wow, we're full on our inventory again already. We really need to get a backpack upgrade. You, 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 and you. And we're going to go ahead and make at least one more for now. Actually, no, let's make up a bunch of them. There. Um, you know, obviously this patch here will probably end up being moved at some point. But we're always going to need access to the water, aren't we? So I think going down this direction would be a great idea for the path. Back to the grind. I do like the animation on this. Especially when you walk through um, patches of grass and plants and things. The way it only moves about in the area that you're, move, that you're walking through. Watch, I'll show you. I think that's really cool. This is a really, really... I know it's kind of dull when you're just sitting here destroying everything, but this is a really, really fun game, guys. There's a lot to do. We just need to get started on it, you know? You don't get everything given to you straight to do straight away. No games like that. So you always have to do the boring little intro bit and get started on things. Yeah. Well. And one of you. Thank you. Might have to start planting these random seeds soon. No idea what they're going to be. Hello. No? Nothing. Okay. So do you guys think that this is a game that you could just sit here and play for hours and hours? I already, ha I d I already know it's one of those types for me. It's not even a very expensive game either. And it only came out... This game is actually relatively new in terms of how long a game has been out for. It came out in February. I know what you mean. Stardew Valley is my new addiction. I spent over 60 hours on it. I am in three years. Yeah, and I, I would, and you're welcome. I did say at the very beginning of the stream, Miller, that it was you who, who donated and suggested the game. So thank you once again for that. And welcome, Creven. My name is Sir Clown. If you didn't already know. <laughs> but I was already, even, even before... I even heard of this game. I've been hooked on um, uh, Harvest Moon games for years. My favourite one being the PS2 version. The three-dimensional PS2 version that I used to have. <laughs> Just got out the bath. <laughs> well, good for you, Miller. Oh, I'm exhausted. Let's see if I can quickly just finish off this tree. There we go. And then it's time for sleep. Oh, you've got to use the path. Don't want to ruin any cro crops or potential crops. Now, I could combine this, this, and this to make something that gives me energy. Here. Gives you 45 energy. But I think we'll pass for today. <laughs> 